But that's harsh, don't you think? No! You're in the middle of a forest, a Hello. jungle, actually. There's the music. Even a swamp, some may say. That... One disc. That's all you have. That was atrocious. That was six discs for two accurate. Uh, six discs on, for man. one accuracy. Oh. And I, I spent 50 bamboo. <laughs> well, you better go get more bamboo. Can I just, like, go buy some? Uh, you may be able to. Okay, because I'm going to need to do, like, another widget run pretty soon. Probably after this session clears, I only have 220. Yeah. Actually, I should probably go duplicate those before I, like, spin them all. Yeah. You should probably also get some bamboo without using your cash. Why would I ever do such a thing? Well, yeah, I forgot. You're one of those folks that are of the opinion... Why spend time playing a game when I can spend some cash and no. super lame? No, I've, I've only done that like once in GTA to get a car. I did not do that in Mass Effect 3 or uh, any other game with microtransactions. But I you just, would've. I appreciate the option is there for people that do choose to do that because for some people time is more valuable than money. Now that does make sense, time being more valuable than money, yeah. I can understand. Time is incredibly valuable. Yeah. So Which that's is why this why game hates me go, so much. We should go the proper directions. Why? And no. Not waste L time. Listen. All it's gonna mean, like, what do I really train in Kokoro that's of any importance? You train willpower. What does that do? Yes. I think that I, I think my will is perfectly fine. My accuracy, however, is not. I need well, to we're going to Kokoro next, whether you like it or not. Fair enough. I just want to have a little bit of an advantage so I don't have to suffer in the Coley match there. I think it makes sense. Okay, I think I understand willpower. I believe one of our fans posted a comment describing what it does, and I believe, from what I can remember, willpower prevents you from being able to, like, be stunned. Hmm. Well, that doesn't so. happen to me much. Well, yeah, it does. Mm-hmm. Uh, I can buy a... <sighs> I'm not sure whether to be sad I wasted 50 bamboo or happy <laughs> that I can buy them for point one widget. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Ten discs for one widget. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me about this? I didn't know. That's awesome. I'll take 50. That's okay. how many I have left. It's like, uh... Oh, what do you mean, how many I have left? Uh, widgets, I mean. Oh, 195. I spent cool. 20 buying a bamboo pole, frivolously thinking I could break it down. But not, <laughs> not only do I not need it, but it doesn't need it. It's just a pole. I can't get bamboo out of that. What do I do with this? I believe there's something you can make using that but let me find out okay thank you man how did lego ever expect this game to like catch on well They're, like little kids to figure all this stuff out <laughs> what did they really expect are you saying kids are dumb no i'm saying that in a game that doesn't really have a tutorial that features a lot of grinding that's primarily geared towards smaller children what really did they expect to happen? Like, there wasn't a guide on the website, was there? Uh, no, I don't think so. Also, yeah. you would have needed that earlier in order to make, like, a hundred widgets for the Coley stick, but you don't need that anymore. Yeah, no, let's not talk about that. Okay. So. You know, Meso, uh, I've got to ask. Considering you've made all the Limator in here Italian for some... <laughs> unknown reason <laughs> what what countries do you imagine each Matoran type I don't really imagine them as anything I just did it for like varieties so. no no I want to hear I want you to give this some thought okay. let's hear it Meso uh, Matoran around the world the, you think the, the Limatoran the po, or Italian the Limatoran or Italian the Po Matoran are like country folk from what country America probably the deep south Oh my goodness. Uh, 
the <laughs> Onumatoran. I don't know. I would say the Onumatoran should be Australian. <laughs> Yeah. For variety's sake, but I can't oh, do wait, it. Oh wait, no. Let me guess, because they're from the land down under. Exactly, but I can't oh, do an Australian no. accent, so forget that. Grant, no, I, I never have to I go back. I can't do a very good one. I never have to go back down to Koro anyway, so it doesn't matter. Komatoran, Komatoran don't talk, but if they did talk, they'd be German. Wait, which Matoran? Komatoran. Komatoran. Ko. Ko. German. Maybe German. Tomatoran or French. And who else? What am I forgetting? Gamatoran. I don't know. Wow. Nobody cares about Gamatoran. Maybe make them uh, British. Matanui. Okay, I can have Viper do all their voices. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think that's a fine list, uh, except for a couple of things. I would make. I'd oh, make Tomatoran American. I never asked for your opinion. Well, you're getting my opinion. All right, let's see you up. Sucks. Oh, there you go. I have 200 discs. That's great. What the? Fuck? I, I I take that back. The the game makers didn't know what they were doing. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. Stuff. I don't think that the Pomatorin should be American. I think that the Comatorin should be, because the, the NSA. NSA. Nah. Yeah. No. I'm wow. playing this. With, I'm playing this with a trackpad. <laughs> Oh my it's, gosh, you and your trackpad! This okay, whole, this whole game is okay I need to explain something to everyone listening. Oh, okay. So Meso, way back when, this group used to play a lot of Minecraft. We'd go on these competitive PvP servers and we'd have a blast. Meso, as, as we have mentioned. somehow, yeah, uh, we've mentioned this before, probably in the same Let's Play. Somehow, Meso survived this entire time and became one of our top three fighters using a trackpad. He refused to use a mouse, so he Look. only had his trackpad, and ever so often, he'd kill someone because he, quote, misclicked. Listen. Yes, Davi? I didn't have a mouse for the longest time. And when I did, I didn't feel like using it. <laughs> and I had already gotten so used to the trackpad via our Halo playing days. Well, really, if you were going to call something out, it became like the best, one of the best players in Halo. I don't want to brag, but in Halo CE, I think I was pretty okay, uh, only using a trackpad. And I think that's what made it easier for me in Minecraft, because it's more simplistic. Uh, the counterbalance was, I would not call myself one of our top three fighters because of my horrible frame rate lag that I would get and still get. Uh, a lot of the times, you guys would send me out on the front lines and I would just be cannon fodder because I couldn't really fight. Like the story we told last time where we broke into the person's base via jumping onto their ceiling. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I couldn't hold my weight in that encounter because their base tanked my frame rate. <laughs> uh, so that was a nice counterbalance. But no, trackpads are perfectly fine. It's kind of uh -huh. like this game. People said Coley was difficult. Well, it is difficult if you're lazy and don't train. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm lazy, which is why I'm not going to be trading uh, via stamina, but even still. It's just one of those well, things. You gotta put the work in, you gotta practice, and everything will be okay in the end. Uh, mouses right. are for scrubs. Moral Mice. Sorry. Are for scrubs. Ma mouses. <laughs> so how much do I really need to do this? Before? Beans, if I know. Fight Lakoro, see how much you've gotten. A wise game master. Hey, stuff it. All right, I'm gonna do like one or two more rounds of stamina, and then I'll fight Likora. Stamina. Oh, sorry, stamina accuracy. Still an Onukoro. Yeah, I, I cannot escape the <laughs> boundaries of Onukoro. Just so you know, we're recording. Yeah, I know. I'm typing. I am responding to oh, our man. loyal... I guess I should have presumed that you would have the professionalism to not type. Professionalism? <laughs> Meso, the only professionalism that people are lacking here is you and your, your incessant need to go other places when I'm telling you you shouldn't be going there! Look. 
I don't know why. This isn't like Manon where I'm breaking immersion by going different places. It's like a f completely free roaming atmosphere. I can go where I want. It's wow. not a free roaming atmosphere. The majority of the time, you sat here complaining. I'm sat here. I'm so British now. You sat, right, you Viper. sat here complaining. You, you sat there complaining that there are only so many frames in any given coral. Well, see, That's not free roam. I, I will bet you. When we get to Kokoro, there will be two, two scenes. Linkara has like seven or eight or nine. That's so? so I know really. the answer to that. Do you really want to make that bet? No, I do not want to make that bet. Wise but, choice. Look, listen, I don't know why you would recommend I go to uh, Kokoro first unless you just want to watch me suffer. <laughs> It's, I'm, I'm, it's better it's to train my guide. actors. I'm going by like, the book here. Like, li listen, is there going to be some story relevant cutscene where somebody attacks Kokoro and destroys it and I, then I'm gonna be like oh no oh, I gotta fight Coley to raise money for the repairs or some stupid thing like that because if not I don't need to be there. First of all, ladies and gentlemen, our very own Messnack of TTV, head of the TTV podcast, just said that charities are stupid. That's not Take what that I said. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, that's all I thought you said. No. So anyway, the second thing is no. However, Kokoro will be important in the future. Well, yeah, it is. When the NSA is revealed, it's like its home base. Yes, of course, Messo. Oh, you're gonna meet some weird people over in Kokoro. Trust me. I really wish I could do a German accent then. Maybe I will make them American. The cop out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. I, I don't think I can do a German accent. I'm, I'm part German. I don't think well, I can do that. Aren't you cool? Yeah. Okay. You're part German too. Time to go fight Likora. Gosh, mess so. Uh, all right, I gotta find my tail. What the heck was that? Don't worry, I've got everything under control. <laughs> so this suffering a terrible calamity. I'll just entertain you all with my stories, so... Don't worry, I'll spare you all from that. Oh, ouch. <laughs> Stings, Elder. For future reference, lamps are going to kill us one day. Did lamp fall over? No. So yeah, lamps are demons. So are cars. Now I gotta go close the window again. Son of a gun. Darn you, professionalism. Yeah, you're really botching it today, huh? <laughs> oh, man. This let's play. I really hope any of you are able to even moderately derive any enjoyment out of this Travis. Hey, <laughs> uh, look. There we go. Mata out. First of all, I heard that. Second of all... Man, you want to talk. Hey, welcome, water lady. Long is the ground path from Seabright Gakoro to Deep Weed Lekoro. Take rest here if you're tired, for you shall need it. Kongo and Tamaru have practiced long and hard and are ready to face you at the Koli Tree. <laughs> I am ready to face the team from Lekoro. Luck be with you and Maku. Go to the Koli Tree and I shall call the match. Okay, fine. <laughs> Off I go, buddy old palo. All right, everyone, are you ready for everyone's favorite part of this Let's Play? The part where Meso gets smacked down so hard he realizes how much of a terrible game player he Wait, is? what? What is this? Oh. Well, you see. What had happened where was... Where am I going? <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember this. What is this? I can't tell you. Okay, fine. Um, so, um... What does it say, Elder? Well, let me see. Screen share hasn't loaded yet, so I can't tell you. Okay, alright, so... For everyone's, uh, understanding, I have the Matorian alphabet right here. And this says, in... I can tell you that much. In... Oh, gosh, where is it? Man, there's so many... Okay, in... Da, da, ba, da, in dark 
Darkness. In, in darkness, light. Riveting. And I guess I put something in this hole. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. No, you don't. No, you don't. Yeah, Wrestle. yeah I do. <laughs> Wrestle, no. You can't fool you me. <laughs> Why would you ever think that? It's probably something I have on me, too. Messo, it is not! Yeah, it is. No, it's not! It totally is. Messo! I'll find it. No! I know it is. You can't fool me. Messo! It's somewhere no. here. It's not. You don't sound too honest there, LJ. Okay, listen, amigo. I'm double checking. <laughs> Let me see. Ha! You don't have it on you right now. Impressive. Well, I'm gonna try anyway. Any attempt I get to break chronology, I'll do it. I'm one of those people that I would play Metroid, and I would always do things out of order. Oh my which is one of the gosh. reasons I love that series. You can do anything in any order that you're able to with your own skill. You can break chronology and get items before others if you really want to. Yet, you're the guy that loves symmetry. Order. Perfection. Symmetrical. I've actually kind of gotten over that. Honestly. I, 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 I like asymmetry when it has a purpose and when it's done to evoke a certain stylistic pattern. I don't like sim asymmetry for the sake of asymmetry. Case in point, Ferno 2.0. <laughs> it's, uh, it, it really bothers me when, like, armor on a set is inverted for no apparent reason, but, you know, certain sets it's pulled off very nicely. I do enjoy it. Case in point, Pohatu. I tried to give him symmetrical arms, but... Quite honestly, I just couldn't do it. Let's see. Uh oh. What, Elder? Nothing, nothing. Are you expecting me to read this? Yes. Okay. Let's see. Uh. Stir. Strit. Stri. Stre, strength. Strength of. Come on, stupid alphabet. What is that one? <laughs> okay. Su, su, su. Fudge, where's the other one? Okay, some. Some something. Some bit, bit, s. Yeah. That's an N, right? N, U, H. Uh, man, so many fans are cursing me out right now. <laughs> N U H B S R E. I heavily doubt that. That's what it is. Strength of numbers, probably. Oh, uh, yeah. Right? Yeah. No, that can't be right. Number? No, yeah, no, that can't be right. What is this? What, what is this? Okay, it, that's an N. The first one's an N. Okay. The second one is a U. Okay, N U. Okay, the third one is. Come on, where's the third one? Man, this alphabet is biting me right now. Oh, oh, the third one's an M. Okay. Are you sure? <laughs> yes, I'm sure. Okay, so that's N U M. Go on. B. No. Numb S. Okay. R. Numbs. E. Strength of numbs. <laughs> numbs. That's what it is. I'm reading it right. What does this mean? What is this? I don't know. Well, you know what these are. You're just not telling me. So they have to have something I, to do with charms, probably. I... I... No? What is this, uh? Uh... I don't know. Let's see. It's probably X. Wait, no, not X. Either. That's W. Okay. Whoa. Work? No. No, that's not... Is that? No, it's not a K. Okay. Word. Word 
of Hon H O N O R. <laughs> oh, word of honor. Oh, okay. I'm looking, I have an honor charm, <laughs> but I don't. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, so. No, sir. <laughs> Yeah, apparently that's that's a typo. Cause I I, it is strength of numbers. Wow. So eat that, fans. You can't get on my case then. All right, I think this is the last one. Oh well, I actually looked it up, so I already know what that means. What that says. Okay, what is it? Faith grants this. Mm. Don't you dare. You knock it off. I bet I have the answer to this. Meso, knock it off! She moved, so for a second I thought I had it. But no. Uh, yes, no. Faith grants. A sluice. See, if you know anything about this game, or you've, if you've asked around, you probably would have it. But like a sucker, you don't. If I asked around, what does that mean? <laughs> if you asked around and understood how the Limatorn of this game operate, you probably would understand. It's not music. Probably need flutes. <sighs> yes, anyway. Meso. The charm of flute. <laughs> I tried every charm I had, so... Evidently, you are right, and you come back later. Yeah. Man, you burned up so much time with those antics. Look, it's awesome, okay? I have to immerse myself in the world. Yes, you immerse yourself in the world. I was mentally preparing myself for the terror. Mentally for the terror that I'm about to go up against. I forget how to even get to the Coley Field. This way. I... Honestly, I don't even remember either. You asked around, you learned the lay of the land. <laughs> don't even start with me, you hypocritical fool. You sicken me. Yeah. Gosh. I will say this this area is pretty cool, even though they aren't. It's kind of empty. Looks <laughs> like there should be more huts. I like this better than I did Onukoro. Mm hmm. Seems like Onukoro and Gakoro swapped places. Onukoro is the super small one. They have like six huts. I wonder if we accurately got all the huts in place. Uh, good question. <sighs> I guess I go up, maybe? I don't know. Lost and confused. Yeah, well. Pretty normal for you. Ouch. <laughs> oh, I think it's that vine right there. Okay. I'm oh, ready. Favorite part is a smackdown. You're probably gonna be super fast and have top notch accuracy too. <laughs> Never gonna miss. Probably. Yep, they're super fast. <laughs> oh my goodness! Get wrecked! Assault. Get wrecked! Oh wow! <laughs> accuracy training did do something that was like perfectly straight. What is going on? Oh that was this brutal. Amazing. It was like just punching each other with coley sticks. <laughs> And this is like hockey. Go, Whoa. Hockey, go! Oh. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if I could ever get to the point where I can throw the ball. Maybe I could learn if my training really worked, you know. Man, it's like they steal it back instantly. <laughs> Yep. 
Now there are ways, there, there are types of training that you can learn in order to prevent from that ball from getting stolen. Yeah. Which is, you know, Kokoro! I, it, I, I, no, that's no, not. He said Kokoro prevents being stunned. Not stolen, stealing the ball. <laughs> I'm gonna look that up. You do that. Oh, why, Grandmaster will. LJ? I will. It's like five to zero at this point. I can't even That's get the ball amazing. to tell if my accuracy has been affected or not. Okay. Will power. It allows Coley players to improve their focus and gain more control during play. Gain more control. Hey, I got the ball. Go on. I want to plant on the board. Good job. Man. Man, fudge. I don't even know what this does. Ugh. Maybe some people will tell us. Yeah, maybe. Also, I saw a couple comments like talking about how the frame rate seems a bit low at times. And I must begrudgingly say that, yeah, it kind of is. There's nothing I can really do about it. I don't have the greatest computer built for uh, gaming, which is one of the reasons why I rarely do Let's Plays. And when I do it, it's point and click games. But. If you ever notice any choppiness, that's why. Like right now, the frame rate's kind of sluggish, and I'm not sure why. But it's kind of unavoidable. Oh well. Yeah, pretty much. Oh well. Scrub tier. It's like the biggest smackdown ever. Like almost 10 to 0. They'll probably get 10 to 0. That's amazing. Yeah. Let's see. Hmm. Kind of smacked Maku with the cold ball. <laughs> I'm kind of, kind of like these guys. I kind of want them to win. Just destroying Maku. Man, I can't even find out what this does, so. I'll assume I need it. Ugh. Yeah, alright guys, you know what it does and what they do. It's Someone posted a know. very comprehensive list of what they all do. I just forget which video yeah. and what comment it was on. Well, we'll hunt it down a bit. Yeah, probably after this video airs. Though. Yeah. So, sorry to all of you, we'll know what it does after this. <laughs>